People often say that telescopes are like time machines. I said it myself recently in an interview, but there's only one problem. It's not true. Telescopes do not travel through time. They stay right here, and more importantly, right now. But they do receive the past through light. Every time I take a picture of a distant galaxy, that light began its journey a long time ago. In fact, that light may have began its travels before humans even existed. Here's what's really happening. Light travels fast, really fast, roughly 300,000 kilometers per second. But space is so vast that even at that speed, it takes an incredibly long time for that light to reach us. To demonstrate this, why don't we take a look at a couple of examples of objects in space, and we'll start with the moon. When you look up at the moon, you're seeing it as it was just over one second ago. The sun, its light is eight minutes old by the time it reaches us. How about the Veil Nebula? A paltry 2,400 light years away, it's a supernova remnant, the ghost of a star that exploded, and we're seeing it over a millennium after it happened. But now check this out. This is the Andromeda Galaxy, one of our closest galactic neighbors. It is over two and a half million light years away. Its light left on its journey when early hominins were just learning to use tools, and it's only arriving right now. Now let's clear something up. Telescopes are not time machines. They don't bend time, and they don't transport us into the past. What they do is show us what was, because of how long it takes light to reach us. So why all the excitement about huge telescopes, like the new 30-meter telescope, or space-based telescopes like the James Webb? Well, it's not all about seeing more detail. It's about seeing deeper into time. The farther we look, the further back in cosmic history we can see because that light has taken longer to reach us. Larger telescopes collect more light. That means they can detect fainter, more distant objects, like the first galaxies that formed just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. These telescopes are literally capturing the universe's baby photos, the first chapter in everything we know, and every improvement in technology turns another page in that story. Every star you see, every image I take, is a message from long ago. We're not just observing space, we're being told a story from the ancient past. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe for future explorations. I am here to make space feel a little bit closer and a lot more relatable. Thanks for watching, and next time you look up, remember, you're not just looking out, you're looking back, way back. <laughs>